Well, 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 what do we have here? Could it actually be the production model of BMW's brand new huge 1800cc cruiser? Well, that couldn't be it. BMW is a huge company and certainly would take care not to have its unrevealed products photographed by curious eyes. Unless... All right, all right, enough suspense. Nowadays, when we all have cameras in our pockets, everything gets leaked. So here is part of BMW's R18 production model. And what a beauty she is. Stick around. The leaked photos actually show two production models, confirming some key details about BMW's upcoming R1800 Cruiser lineup. In the end, we should see a Cruiser, a Tourer and a Bagger. Now comparing the R18 prototype to the leaked photo, we can see a few similarities and a couple of things that have changed. The engine has remained nearly unchanged in all of its glory, but instead of being carbureted, it's obviously now using direct injection as there is no way a carbureted engine would pass the latest Euro 5 pollution standards. The nameplate on the engine also no longer reads R18, but just 1800cc. Now when people see the bike, they no longer have to ask you, how big is that? The cradle frame from the prototype seems to have made it over to the production model, and so has the beautiful drop-shaped fuel tank. No surprises when it comes to the suspension as well, it's the same as the prototype, but there is one addition behind it and that is a steering damper to make maneuvering the bike a lot easier. Necessary street legal items have been added to the bike such as turn signals obviously and mirrors obviously obviously and electronics wise expect the bike to come with the bare minimum. Traction control to keep all those untamed horses at bay and cornering ABS to keep you safer on the road. And that's about it. No fancy LCD instrument panel, no phone connectivity. As I mentioned in a previous episode, this is one of BMW's emotional bikes in their lineup. So they want to let you recapture that feeling of freedom when it's just the road, the bike and you. So nothing to distract from that. All in all, there will probably be three versions available. Two of them were shown in these latest leaks, a naked cruiser and a tour version with a larger windshield and leather bags. And earlier this year, there was another cruiser spotted on the highways of Germany. When BMW will announce this lineup is absolute speculation at the moment. They should see dealership floors in early 2020. They should also definitely be on display at EICMA in November, where, by the way, we will be attending, so make sure you are subscribed to catch all the news in the motorcycle world. But if we are to go by how BMW has been doing things lately, they will be announced officially just a little before EICMA. Short and sweet episode today, are you ready to put your payment down on the new cruiser? Does it tickle your fancy? Has BMW got you excited for the official reveal yet? Or are you into something else? Let us know in the comments. Well that's the show everybody, give it a big thumbs up if you've enjoyed it and if you think you've learned something new consider subscribing or becoming a patron to help us make more of these shows. Cheers and I'll see you on the next one.